Okay, a bit busy at the moment. Uh, so we've actually been working in the orchard. I've got back slightly later than I knew we had expected to get back. We're looking forward to having this wonderful leg of lamb that we've been looking forward to. Um, uh, bought this at uh, the best butcher in the country that I know, H.J. Edwards, you know, bigger than any. However, it's a bit late. So, I'm going to butterfly that. And uh, just for a change, I thought I'd use this Transforce Brooks, which I've obviously given a good clean to. Just give you an idea of what you know, these axes are capable of. It's often a useful way, um, you know, filleting a, a joint is often a, a, a very uh, good way, uh, A, to increase the variety of things that you can do with a joint, B, to get more um, flavour into it, such as uh, teriyaki sauce, for example, which goes very well with lamb. Um, but it's a good time saver quite often, and that's the main reason on this occasion. Um, so it's six o'clock and we, we, there was always more work to do than you think. And uh, so we got back a bit later than I'd anticipated. And um, so you said, we haven't got time to uh, cook that roast leg of now. And I said, yes, we have, especially if I, uh, if we have it anyway, I said, if I, um, we have got time if I fill it up. So, there we go. Not much waste on one of these, but given that I'm going to bung that in here, and given that I'm going to, um, well, it's, not, it's not perfect, Philip, but you know, uh, given that I'm going to put this in here anyway, with that, like, you must wash your hands because I've just touched raw meat. Mind you, yeah, pretty cool. Mm. A little bit of teriyaki sauce. You can't go wrong. Observe the fact that I'm not putting my fingers over that. Okay, uh, keep it clean, boys and girls. Okay, anyway, so that's just a little bit of uh, a bit of axe, and um, what can what can I say? Grand Brooks.